Sure, there's a warehouse across the way, but this little pocket of Leaside has a lot to offer. It's fantastic, it's developing, it's uh, growing. New builds, condos, you're close to the highway, there's green space, transit, and the Crosstown is coming. These townhouses go on sale for about two days, literally, and they're sold. Wayne Chusid bought here eight years ago. He's looking forward to getting his home assessment in the mail next month. I think it just keeps going up. And certainly in Toronto and the GTA, that's outpaced most of the rest of the province. The people who assess homes in this province say market trends speak for themselves. Homes in this city are selling high and as a result, they are worth more, about 7 or 8 percent a year. We look at the sales that have occurred as close to the, uh, the property itself and we then determine from that um, what the value of that property should be. Your home is assessed based on five main factors. Outlined in these new videos, the Municipal Property Assessment Corporation, or MPAC, released today. Location drives the value more than anything else. But sky high prices and assessments have driven some people out of the market altogether. You need a million dollars, you know, and where did most people get that? You know, I'm 58 now, I could never buy again. Sharon Skinner is renting for now, but hoping to buy. You gotta wait for a little bit of a dip. Yeah, I mean, just exactly. But it sounds like it could be a while before her and Bob have new digs. There's a house there for sale, and that says sold over asking. Yeah, that's not uncommon in Toronto right now. I think that's the norm. Uh, unfortunately, I think it is.